Hey, I'm Rain, and this is my new channel, Vermilion Ultra Life. I plan on sharing with you my journey on my business uh, adventure as a female entrepreneur and also a new mother, and my struggles and the things that I'm going through to get to where I want to be in life. Um, if you know what I mean, I've gone from working four jobs um, all at the same time to working one good warehouse job at the moment. Um, and before that, I worked for 12 jobs, so it's been a rocky ride since I was 16. Um, but most, but yeah, I pretty much quit and just moved on to the next big thing. But at this point, I'm like super done with that 9 to 5 or really 10 or 12 shifts. And I'm ready to venture out on my own and create my own business. And recently, I came across box trucking. I almost fell for this job where I was going to be a box truck driver uh, for a certain company and like it, it just didn't add up. They weren't showing me the hourly. They were just saying, oh, 60,000 a year. And I'm just like, oh, that's great. That's great. I'm going to do it. But then it says like 50 hours plus. And I'm like, I have a baby now. Or I could do that. I do that. No problem. <laughs> but now that that's just not going to work. I want to create my own hours, and you know I'm a very hard worker. I've been working at a warehouse um, that I currently work at for two years, and I was pregnant, eight months pregnant, on the warehouse floor. I wouldn't see they sit down, um, <laughs> hold on my feet, and lifting boxes and stuff like that. But you know nothing too serious. I just made my boyfriend do most of it that was heavy because you know I'm not gonna put our child at risk um you know his job's not worth that so yeah at this point i'm i'm just done with it i i really want to venture out on my own and have my own channel and talk about what i'm going to do and what i'm going to do is right now i'm going to open up box checking business i already got started but i'm kind of like in a waiting process because you have to wait for your authority and you know you got to go through all these steps and stuff and uh, this is a whole big old can of worms I'm going to open up in a different video <laughs> so right now I just wanted to talk to you guys about what I plan to do and my overall goal for this channel so my overall goal is I really want to be able to make my own hours and use this job and this as a stepping stone so that I can sell enough money for my family and also be able to invest in like higher photo uh, quality kind of stuff like what am I saying? <laughs> like a uh, camera that's what I want long camera and I want to take pictures and um, you know start this a uh, whole other business too like I have this idea and I just want to take pictures of nature and stuff and like sell really nice um, wall art and stuff like that. And um, also the goal is after I'm done doing this box trucking business um, to supplement all the other businesses, which one of them being I really want to make YouTube more of a full time thing and um, you know pretty much somebody's running water upstairs and I think it's, it, it's like distracting me. Uh, <laughs> but um, yeah, take two or twenty really. But anyway, so I really, really want to be a vlogger and go around and maybe like try food, travel, uh, talk about all the things that we learn. Um, really just spend all the time with my family as possible but I know I have to make sacrifices right now and I'm willing to do that I'm willing to work you know eight ten hours uh, I know I can work like four just in total this for the day I looked that up for box trucking and I'm super glad about that because I'd rather get that I'd rather get it all over with than you know be stuck at these hourlies uh, I really got in pretty good with doing like you know four days a week right now uh because i used to work every single day i have 
like four jobs and it was insane it was pretty much like no sleep just you know get up and go to job then go to the next job you don't go to sleep <laughs> it, it was intense and I didn't do it for very long I would just skip to the next thing because I was like oh I need full-time work and over where I come from it's really intense and stuff but just it's it's a lot but I have a lot to talk about and I can ramble on and on and on but I'm just gonna leave it at this that you can watch my channel to learn advice and you know really um, learn with me because I'm definitely not sure anything but I'm getting smarter recently and just being like I, I'm done I'm done with hourly I'm done with you know not doing my own thing I, I'm an entrepreneur I've been doing stuff like this since I was little like I used to be able to sell pins to people pins and cars whatever I had uh, had at home I would just go around and sell it because you know I've always had that mindset I want to be um doing my own thing and that's what I plan to do here so if you like what you hear or you want to learn more about me just leave a comment below uh, like and subscribe bye guys okay so I know how YouTube works and there's no PS letters, but I'm going to make a PS letter right now because why not? So when I'm working at the warehouse, it's really difficult for me to pump because I'm a new mother and my little girl, she's six months um, on the 24th of July. And, you know, I still have to feed her milk. I'm not going to like give her that formula or anything. I mean, nothing against people that do that, but, you know, I was lucky enough to be able to make my own milk. So what I do is I pump with a portable pump and it took me forever to find this pump. It's right here. You literally, this is it. There's no cord. Um, it pumps, you know, I have two breaks and a lunch. So I break, um, for like, it's really 15 minutes. Uh, but it comes down to being like 10 minutes that I get to pump. And, um, I don't go in the mother's room because I'm just worried that I might get in trouble. <laughs> I know that's silly, but I'd rather just get it out, get it over with and get back to work. Um, so I pump for like 10 minutes, go wash it, put it away, um, put the milk away in the fridge. And then, um, I pump the full 30 minutes for my lunch and then I pump again, uh, for 15, like 10 more minutes. I mean and then that's the end of the shift and I get a good amount of milk and I'm making it like this thing has been a lifesaver and I'm gonna put a link into this video so go ahead and get yourself one of these because it's pretty great and I'm gonna do another video on it so like I can teach you how it works and stuff because I, I had a horrible time when I learned to pump and all this and it was just a lot on me and I know there's people out there that don't really know how to do this and they're modest like me and they don't really want to show anything so i can give you as much advice as i can um and try to help you out there because you know if you gotta work you need a pump and nobody should be telling you you can't i put it under my shirt and i pull it out in front of everybody i'm just like hoping nobody's looking <laughs> nobody can see anything I swear. But anyway, like and subscribe. I'll see you later. Bye.